So in today's video, I wanna share with you one little productivity hack that I use to get a lot more work done, and it's very simple. Before I tell it to you, let me just set the stage. So I'm gonna give you an example of the bare essentials that I needed to get accomplished in a typical day for me last week when I was midway through doing one of my 10 day strive challenges. Okay, so here's the list of things I needed to do. So I needed to wake up 6 a.m., walk my dogs, I've got three of them, work out where I do eight three minute rounds in the boxing bag. Then I needed to do a live stream simultaneously to YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and then I walk the dogs again towards the end of the day, all three of them. Launch my new program, it's called the Strive 10 Day Challenge. So I had to get that done as well. Uh, and mainly that was just writing the getting started lesson. And then I needed to record a few welcome videos. I then had to write a blog post, email my list, post a YouTube vlog episode for the day, and finally record a training lesson for my video editing masterclass course. So that list, those were my bare essential tasks for the day. And no matter what happened, I needed to get all of them done before I could finish the day and then reward myself by watching Netflix, which is usually what I do. But of course, just like you would experience in your days, there's all these unplanned interruptions and things which tend to sidetrack you. So on this particular day, I had to go and get gasoline for the gardener here at the hotel so he could continue cutting grass, I had to go running rants, buy some groceries, and then answering Skype messages, emails, social media, which probably took up an hour or two hours. And then I had to upload some Stribe course raw footage for our editors and a lot of other smaller time consuming petty things not worth mentioning. Now typically my days are usually not quite this busy, but again, this was a Strive challenge that I was doing, so things were a little bit more hectic, but let me get to the point. So my productivity hack or little trick to getting all these things done in this one day is simple. It is to minimize any dead time. Dead time is when I'm at my desk and I start to feel that I'm losing focus and efficiency. So I start watching random YouTube videos or I start clicking through all my browser tabs and going down all these different rabbit holes. And when I sense that this is happening, I try and get myself back on course. I tell myself, focus, 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 okay? I try and talk myself and motivate myself to just focus. But if I still can't focus, then what I do is I usually get up, I leave my desk, and I go and do something else in a different location, a completely different task, which is still on my essential list, but it's a different environment, it's a different mindset to get it done. So on this particular day, I start to notice I'm declining around 3 p.m. I'm about to go into one of those dead time phases. So what do I do? I go to the gym, I do my workout, I walk the dogs for the second time, but earlier in the day, so at least I'm crossing things off my essential task list. I'm still getting things done. And by changing the environment and changing the task, now it gives you a chance to recharge your focus. It gives you a chance to recover so that when you go and sit back down at your desk, now you're ready to go but you haven't lost momentum. You're still getting the essential things done. And what a lot of people do wrong is when they start to, they notice their, their focus is declining, they just stay where they are and they start to get distracted. They start clicking around, watching videos, and before they know it, they've wasted an hour. The problem is that now they've started to lose that momentum in the day and they've still got things on their essential task list which are not getting done. So what I do is I minimize dead time. I change the environment, I change the mode, but I'm still getting done the essential things. So that's really important. I hope that helps you. And just while we're on this topic of productivity, productivity is something you hear me talk about a lot because you can have two people and both of them can be equal intelligence and have everything going for them the same but the one who's more efficient and productive with their time, they're always gonna get a lot more done. And these are skills that you can learn. So in 2021, we're actually gonna have a training event on this, a live in-person training event, which will go for seven days, six nights. It's one of our Strive seminar vacations where you get everything included, food, drinks, entertainment, everything for two people. 
Now half the day you're going to be learning, you're going to be in the seminar room learning about these kind of things. The second half of the day we're going to be out enjoying Costa Rica, going and doing all the different activities, the ATVs, the zip lines, the sunset cruises, the national parks. But this particular seminar vacation, it's all about increasing your performance. So your ability to focus and concentrate, uh, how quickly you can learn things, how, how well you can retain information. So the different trainers we have coming in, they are all experts in their area. And that's what the whole thing is going to be about. If you'd like to know more about that, there should be a link somewhere below. But the good thing is when you join Strive, you're going to start accumulating your seminar vacation points. And when you have enough points, then you get to come to a seminar vacation. And we have one planned every single month of 2021. So if you want to know more about that, there should be a link somewhere below this video. Click it, go and check it out, take action. But regardless, I hope you get some value out of this video and I'll see you tomorrow. Speak soon.